We're entering the exhibition of John Pittman Weber being held at Benedictine University's Father Michael E. Komachek OSB Art Gallery. John Pittman Weber is a Chicago artist, painter, printmaker, muralist, whose work encompasses many different series of styles. His most recent series, which we see here, is one of many of prints of migrants, people who are traveling, detained, being held from their destinations. There are large woodcuts, life-size, larger than life-size. This is a title piece called Migrant, which is from the exhibition, which runs from August 28th until October 10th. John Pittman Weber is an artist originally from New York, Brooklyn. Came to Chicago many years ago, about 45 years ago. After studying at Harvard University, he went to the Art Institute of Chicago, studied printmaker for a brief period of time on a grant uh, while living in Paris. He is a master etcher, woodcut artist, draftsman, and a painter. He works with the Chicago Artist Mural Group, public art group, which was founded about 45 years ago in Chicago and spends its time making um, art in public spaces for communities of the South and the West neighborhoods of the city. He's also taught mural making, mosaic style making, um, at Elmhurst College. He is a professor emeritus from Elmhurst College. Uh, lives in Chicago now at the Pilsen neighborhood, largely Latino neighborhood, where a lot of the murals that he participates take place. A lot of the work that's in this exhibition are from the a group of uh, series that he's worked on. This first exhibit, uh, first image rather, is of a print of himself as a boy. He said that when he was in upstate New York, he went to um, a farm in the upstate New York and he lived on the farm and worked on the farm and in, these are an image that sort of reflects his eerie early experiences with nature. Um, he also does a lot of images that deal with conflict, worldwide conflicts. This particular image is being donated to Benedictine University's permanent art collection. It's called the Mar Marys, different Madonna figures throughout history and throughout the world. A lot of his paintings have to do with compartments, sections, segments or memories, fragments, exposures to different uh, current events, how we compartmentalize that information in our own lives, how we choose to see or not see that information and what we choose to allow ourselves to be exposed to, uh, what we allow ourselves to see with blinders on. He also talks a lot about drones, spying, misinformation. He talks about things that we don't want to know about and what we allow ourselves to be exposed to or not exposed to enough. The series that you see here, these drawing series, these barbed wire pieces, have to do with his interest in looking at cultures that create borders. Uh, some of the barbed wire that you see um, it has to do with the first barbed wire made in the United States, which comes from DeKalb, Illinois. The razor barbed wire is more about a contemporary version of barbed wire used between countries, especially between the U.S.-Mexican border, to keep immigrants out. It's also a type of barbed wire he experienced in seeing when he was in Israel, um, creating borders throughout the Middle East. Uh, this other painting is Boots On, I believe. Shows different compartmental pieces of information. It shows marching boots. It shows dead people piled and piled on top of each other. Again, misinformation, drones. It shows people screaming in pain. It shows confinement with the fences, and it shows uh, another segment that comes up as one of his series, which has to do with oil refineries and exposure of the land to the oil industry how it tries to pump out the natural reserves of the world for the purpose of our needs for oil and how it's actually raping the, the, the Earth's reserves. So this is part of a series of his that deals with that topic, oil refineries. 
Other pieces that we have in the exhibition, more lithographs, um, come from an earlier time period. This is a, one about uh, peaceful, a peaceful piece about women workers making uh, objects for sale. Um, Guatemala, Latin America, Mexico, um, places that he's visited, places he's worked with, other artists and making some of his murals, uh, made some prints, um, dealing with exchange of culture, exchange of information. Um, this is one of the pieces in the exhibit that's maybe a little bit more forceful about the forces of the army, military, those that guard, not so sympathetic to the plights of the immigrants. Other prints are ones, earlier ones from his career in Mexico. Conflict in South Africa. Again, a very large drawing of barbed wire. And again, more images of migrants. So this exhibition at Benedictine University is uh, the first of our 2014-2015-2016 uh, season. It is um, an excellent, wonderful exhibition about perspectives on now, which is the title of the exhibit. We're very proud to have produced it here, very proud to have had John Pittman Weber come talk to us and tell us more and more about his work and his life. Thank you for joining us today.